there's great training available and we get to see and do so much within our roles. I'm currently completing my Nuffield Farming Scholarship, which I've been doing with Nuffield Australia. I've been given some great opportunities to learn with different training options in regards to nutrition and health, cattle handling, our horsemanship skills. I would really love to obviously work your way up and one day, yeah, be a station manager. And I think you can absolutely see that opportunity within CBC, like they want you to have that as your goal as well and like what can we do to get you there um, like things like sending staff members away to leadership training and if they if they see that potential in you they're yeah I'm more than happy to give you that opportunity and whether it's at the station you're at currently or heading to one of the smaller stations uh, there's definitely definitely the opportunity to get there if you're willing to. Done. So just our basic induction and everything like that. Otherwise we've done like cattle handling, horse handling, horse breaking in, shoeing, truck licenses, yeah, truck licenses, um, um, manager conferences and everything like yeah. that. And then they've done a, um, a leadership a, conference as well. Yeah, there's a lot of leadership about. conferences that head stockmen yeah. and that go to. Our grader driver did a erosion course. Yeah. Uh, I was doing um, shoeing school, which was an amazing experience. You know, I'd never learned so much about horses. How all the back sort of stuff behind the scenes that you don't get to see into uh, making a horse fit and ready to ride. Uh, and that was, yeah, very, very interesting. Yeah, early in the year we had Wayne Bain, who's a bit of a territory legend. He came down and gave us all some horse riding tips, which was awesome to have him. And then we had another one, Tom Shepard, who yeah really drilled us on low stress stock handling, which yeah. I think made it a lot more efficient for the yard. So it was it was pretty good. Efficient stock handling school. I've done a horse school and I've done a shoeing school. So they were all really good opportunities, and I learned a lot from all of those things. Uh, nutrition, yeah, nutrition courses, yeah. It's really good, like that CPC offers a lot of um, a lot of training. I think it's really good. The horsemanship side, it's really good. Yeah. The schools we did at the beginning of the year, even yeah. I did them, they were yeah. great. Yeah, yeah, even yeah. before this challenge, it was pretty, like, Cobby was teaching us and everything. It was a lot more, like, even though we were all together, it was a bit more one-on-one. As a ring out, there's things like the horse, horse riding school, there's even uh, colt breaking schools, shoeing schools, and then uh, there's nutrition edge courses, breeding edge courses, uh, first aid. Gosh, where, there's so much. I feel like there's so much training that goes on throughout the year. It, it doesn't matter if it's you know the cattle handling side or horses side or nutrition. We just get so much opportunity to learn, and, and we're always being asked where we want to progress, and and then it's worked on our, our leaders and mentors all through the company help us with what we want to learn. We also had a Tommy Shepherd school and uh, I found that very, um, you know, it was good to learn a heap and uh, just figured out kind of how to go about working cattle a bit more in different situations where you feel like you don't know what to do and uh, yeah. Learn like we've got the opportunity to go like over to Rockhampton and participate in like meat judging. Um, it's currently doing a cert three in ag as a part as well. So we have a trainer come out and see us every three months or so with a bit of online training as well. Um, we're looking into getting our truck licenses as well. Just all these opportunities that I wouldn't have even thought about, and like they're actually coming up to us and offering them to us without going to them like basic horse skills, you know, like moving cattle, you know, low stress stock handling and everything like that. And Anna actually took us to a, a gun license course in Blackpool at the start of the year. So we got to do that as well, um, which I think is pretty important for a lot of us and our backgrounds and everything. Like it was great to get that behind us. And. Um...